I'm just on my way right now to go and get my Botox done in my jaw. Um, I go to Natalie for my Botox lip filler, anything like that. She's absolutely incredible. She is actually a dentist or an orthodontist. I don't know what to actually call her, but dentist teeth stuff. Um, so she's like a medic, which I think is really important. Um, as I've got older, I've realized the importance, this isn't sponsored or anything. Um, I've realized the importance of going to someone who has medical training. Um, and I would personally never ever go to someone ever again that doesn't have medical training. Um, so yeah. Natalie is amazing and she suggested that I get Botox in my jaw because I was looking at buckle fat removal because I've got quite chubby cheeks and then we were talking about it a little bit more and we kind of realized that I actually clench my jaw a lot and I never noticed before but I get really bad pain well I had noticed it but I hadn't kind of put the two together I get really bad pain in my jaw um all like around here i get just like severe pain um when i grind my teeth i clench uh, my mouth shut i'm a very tense person like when i go for a massage she's always like relaxed and i'm literally lying there like this like i cannot help it. i'm a very tense person my mom is the exact same like my mom can be sit sitting there watching a film and she's like this on the sofa like clenching all of her hands up i must get it from her all done so this is after if you've never had botox you might be like is there downtime or anything this is straight after so i've got obviously a little bit of redness because i have just had a needle stuck in my face i've got a teeny tiny bruise there um she said you might have a little bit of a bruise there um i don't usually bruise but you know you can never predict whether you're gonna bruise or not it only looks tiny if i do but that literally took what time is it now uh, it took 15 minutes from me getting through the door to getting back in my car from the first time i ever met natalie i felt really like comfortable with her which i think that's a really good quality to have when you have a job like that do you know what i mean i really fancy going out for some food today i don't know if lou's gonna be in the mood or not but i really fancy going for like a sunday dinner by the river or something obviously in oxford we've got like the thames running through the whole of oxford so there's loads of like really nice riverside um pubs and stuff so i really really fancy oh yeah really fancy doing that Isn't it a lovely babe? Yeah, it is. Hi. Hi, I'm Victoria. Hi. Nice to meet you. Hi. Hi, I'm Victoria. I won't. Good morning, oh my god, I'm running literally so late. I'm running literally so late. I don't know why I'm choosing to vlog right now because I literally need to be out the door in like three minutes. Um, today I'm going to the Naked Weave salon to get some new hair extensions, it's really exciting. We are working on like a big shoot today, we're doing like a big like video photo shoot today. This is kind of cute, I need some lip balm on because my lips look so pasty. This is one of my favorites, it's from Dior. It looks like it's going to be bright red, but it's literally not. It's pretty much the same colour as my lips. Ready to go. I've actually just popped on my Max Mara cardigan instead because this has been in my wardrobe for ages because obviously it's warm right now, so I can't wear it. And I wanted to just chuck it on because I've missed it. It's one of my favourite cardigans. Actually, it is my favourite cardigan ever. I love this. Putting stuff down. Is the needle there? Is the needle? Oh, yeah, that's fine. Oh, my God, it's lovely. Yeah. It, the ends blend fine, look. Yeah. Perfectly. Yeah. Hello loves. I am on my way home now. Oh my God, this hair is just incredible. I am gobsmacked. It is so nice. Like it is literally so nice it's so long right now i think i'm gonna keep it a little bit this long i don't usually have hair this long but i just thought it'd be fun to keep for a while um 
yeah, I feel like I bought Princess Hair. It's so nice. Um, oh, the guy is giving away to me. Thank you. Two seconds while I merge. Sorry, that is just such a busy junction. You can't be like talking or anything like that. It's like way too busy. Everyone moans on the way so well. Like that's not gonna fix it for you. But yeah, I am obsessed with this hair. I love it. I love how long it is. It's so much fun. Um, I can never deal with hair this long in like long term life. I could have it for a week or two, but I couldn't keep it this long for months. We're gonna cut it to like here, I guess. But oh my god, it's just so nice. I'm so happy for Ola. Like what she has created is just crazy. It's insane. I've never tried this before. Very refreshing. Hey babes! I am just on the way to go and get a facial. I am really nervous. I've never had a facial before in my whole life. Um, the closest thing I've ever had is a massage and I was really nervous about that as well. I'm a really awkward person. Like, I'm really awkward. If you watched a video of me getting my hair done last week, I am awkward. I'm just awkward. Like, I'm an awkward person. I, don't, I can't explain it. Hopefully people can relate to it, but like, Unless I know someone really well, I'm an awkward person. It takes a while for me to open up. I'm really shy, so I always find these situations really intimidating. Like, if I end up coming here for a facial like once every couple of months and I get to know the woman, it'll be chill. But until then, I am the most awkward person ever. Let me know if you can relate to that because sometimes I feel like I'm alone in this. Like, I don't know. It's kind of embarrassing, honestly, it actually is. But anyway, I'm facing my fear. I'm going to get a facial. I'm getting a hydro facial, which I'm really excited about because apparently they're supposed to like do like a bit of extraction, like get the gunk out of your pores, which I'm really looking forward to because I have a few like blocked pores, like I can see little bits in there. Um, apparently it just makes you really glowy and like brightens your skin and everything, which is exactly what I'm looking for from a facial. And also because I have eyelash extensions, I can't do like a facial where they like steam you or put towels over your face, obviously because my eyelashes, you can't like go in a steam room with eyelash extensions because they'll all fall out. Um, so yeah, I'm really looking forward to this. That is absolutely disgusting. Oh my god, that is minging. I my skin is so glowy. My skin is so glowy. And you know how I said I had that rash on my cheekbone? That seems to be looking a little bit better. So yeah, it was really, really enjoyable. So glad I did it and my skin looks so nice and glowy. Oh my god, she showed me in like the bottle of gunk, like all the stuff that comes out of your skin. I'm gonna show you that clip right now here it is this is all the stuff that came out my skin you can see more with your actual eye but there were like loads of like little pieces of dead skin floating around and like these little black bits which i can only presume are blackheads Ugh, disgusting like i can't believe that came out of my face to say that i used like all these products and wash my face every night like religiously i never missed washing my face like i never just use a makeup wipe i always wash my face it looks really good actually. It looks really glowy. I'm liking this. I'm really enjoying this. Look at this. Are you actually kidding me? Absolutely delicious. Good morning. Can you guess which Muppet forgot to put an SD card in her camera? I'm trying to put my steering wheel down, but I've honestly forgotten how you do it and I don't want to break it. I know it's electric. Uh, I just can't remember where the <laughs> But yeah, I forgot to put the SD card in my camera because I've actually been awake since 5.30. Um, it's now 7. I woke up at 5.30, had a shower, washed my eyelashes because I'm currently on the way to an eyelash appointment. Fed the dogs, I had to put fuel in because I didn't do it yesterday because I'm silly. Um, but yeah, honestly. I look like a bit of a state right now. I'm not taking these glasses off because it gets worse without the glasses. But I'm just at Starbucks getting myself a pumpkin cream cold brew coffee because that sounds absolutely delicious right now. 
um so that's what i'm getting hopefully that's gonna wake me up a little bit i've got about 50 minutes left on my drive i'm going to get my eyelashes done today and my nails and a pedicure as well ready for holiday i'm still half asleep so i will see you at my eyelash appointment i'm probably not going to speak because me and annette are usually like blah, 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 blah. i'll probably just get some clips of my eyes um but yeah i'll see you there i need this coffee i'm so excited for this coffee my first pumpkin spice anything of the awesome season